Hi guys, so because today is my very last day off, I decided to start the day off early. With some meal prepping because the meal prep has to happen when I'm off. Mainly because the days where I'm not off, I'm going to need lunch for five days. Or maybe not five, but at least... Friday and Saturday I can buy pasta at work, but I also don't want to do that. So I think I'm going to make a shrimp pasta today too. I just need to see how much shrimp I actually have. I'm going to fix my face and come back. Like I was saying before, I have an outline of things that I want to get done today. And that is I have to refill my fingernails because one broke off, so I need to fix the one that broke off. I feel like, and I might be the only person who feel like this, but I feel like if you have a broken nail, it just makes you look so ratchet. So as soon as one of mine break, I literally have to fix it and if I see that I'm not going to have any time to fix it, I will dig them all off because I don't want to walk around with one broken. Since I'm home, it hasn't bothered me somewhat because I know I'm home and I'm not going anywhere, but I need to fix it today or I'm going to dig them off because I have work tomorrow. <clears throat> so that's one of the things I have to get done today. I want to sweep and wipe the floors today. Yesterday I changed my sheets. I started the morning off by putting... Um, six pieces of sweet potato in the oven and i want to follow that with um while the oven while the oven is still hot i want to follow that with baking uh banana bread i specifically used the smaller pan um yesterday because i knew that i wanted to use the bigger one today oh i think i also have like a regular cake mate i don't really like that one i'm not gonna lie but my husband really likes it no, I don't want to make that because now I'm not going to eat any of it in the banana bread. I'm not really too impressed with. So, and, and I'm getting way ahead of myself here. So I also took goat and pork out. So I'm going to cook curry goat and stew pork. Yesterday I made stew chicken. That's for the meal prepping. I'm also going to make the shrimp pasta. So as I'm talking about it before I forget because I feel like if I don't put all the stuff out that I'm planning to cook then I will forget. So, I want to make some shrimp pasta, which means that I'm going to have to take the shrimp out from now. I thought I had another bag of shrimp. However, I can't find it. Which means I'm just going to have this tiny bag or I'm going to go to the store and God knows, not in the mood to go to the store. I'm wondering if, if Postmates, Postmates is working because if Postmates is working, I'm going to just Postmates me some stuff that I actually need. So I have the shrimp out here. This could make a little bit of pasta. But for the most part, you know, I have the morning under control. And it is just 8.59. So pretty much 9 a.m. Because I woke up super early this morning. And, um, yeah. So I'm going to see how much I can get done. I'm going to leave doing my nails for last. Because it is dusty and stuff like that. And I don't want to go back and forth between doing my nails and cooking. Because that's very unsanitary. So um, I'm going to leave that for a little bit later. But right now I'm really going to check if post Postmates is working. God damn it. So um, yeah. I still haven't washed my hair yet either. So later on when I'm going to go shower. I'm going to also get my hair wash but I'm sitting down at my computer finishing up and upload and then um pretty much customizing it inside of the um YouTube app so I'm multitasking with I gave the sweet potatoes 40 minutes so I want to see if I can do the banana finish this up really quickly and get the banana bread mixture ready within the next probably 35 minutes because probably five to eight minutes since the potatoes have been in there so yeah all right so i just got done with sweeping the whole place and it has literally been um there's 17 minutes left on the potatoes so um what do i want to do I don't know. I think I'm going to leave the banana bread. I think I'm going to leave the cornbread because if there's something else, then doing is not going to eat the cornbread. And it's going to be wasted. And I don't know if I want to waste the cornbread. I also need... Oh, I said I was checking to see if Postmates delivers in this area. So let me check now to see. The grocery store that I, that I usually go to out the block, the other day when I was leaving, I saw that they said they um, deliver. And I'm just like, they do? 
but I didn't even follow it up or anything. But now I'm gonna take advantage of that. Postmates is now what I had in mind. I'm thinking Instacart because what I want is for somebody to do the shopping for me. Because one, I'm gonna have to get an Uber to go to the grocery store and if I don't, I'm gonna have to walk there and I'm gonna have to get a taxi or another Uber to come back with me with the groceries. So if I do this, I'm gonna pay the same amount and like the delivery fee. So, so far this looks like it's kind of working out. This really shows you how expensive shit is. So I'm gonna go do this and then come back. It's been a hot minute, but I feel like I'm doing really good on the timing. Right now it's 11.17. I have my curry goat going. I have my stew pork going. Really good. I'm so happy. I baked the sweet potatoes, so those are ready. I think a little bit later on I'm going to take them out and bake some more. Because you can't have enough. Well, I can't have enough just because I'm dying. You know? So, um, sorry. And I just took some um, cabbage out along with some... green beans, some string beans, and um, some carrots that I'm going to make. So, I'm doing pretty good. I ordered my stuff from Instacart. Claudie's shopping your order. Three of eight items shopped. View. I like this. It's telling me, oh, it's a guy who's, who's shopping for me. <laughs> that is crazy. And it tells me what is already prepared. But um, it says he already found four out of the eight items that I ordered. <clears throat> Love that for me. Now I can really stay home and not go to the grocery store. I don't mind going. It's just sometimes this is so convenient like now. Um, yeah, so I'm buying some more chicken and stuff like that. Anyways, I'm about to go. So guys, the app is telling me where the person is with my delivery. And so far, it looks like he's like one, two, three blocks away. So I'm going to run downstairs to get the stuff. I threw my robe on because I don't want to look inappropriate. <laughs> so I'm going to go get them now. So we'll see. Got my delivery. So I said to the guy, I'm like, was it hard finding this stuff? He was like, yeah, I'm <laughs> like, it was. I tried to make it so easy. So let me show you guys what I got. It's called Instacart. So what you do is, it tells you the amount of stores that are close to you. And then, what is this saying? How would you rate the replacement of your items? They replaced all oh, the shrimp. It was good. Shit is expensive, but it's good. Um, and they said, how would I rate the guy? He was really nice. That's good. So it shows you um, the stores that are in and around the area that they're going to shop from. And then you choose which store you want. So I was shopping from, um, from a key food. So initially I had, um, what's it called? Costco on there. And then I switched to key foods because I realized that some of the things were a little bit cheaper, I guess. Now I can do this when, if you pick a certain item and they can't find it, they'll replace the item for you. But they'll show you the replacement item too. So at least you have an idea of what you're going to be getting instead. Which I think is really good. Um, so when the guy replaced the stuff too inside of the store, like he was inside of the store searching and he couldn't find my stuff, he replaced it and they showed you what he replaced it with and asked if you wanted to approve it or not. So I'm assuming if you don't approve it, then they will not get that one and you just won't get the item, but I'm so happy. So freaking happy. Now, my meat is finishing up. The stew pork is ready, but the goat is taking a little bit longer, but I'm so happy.
Oh, so I put the groceries away and, you know, the meat is finishing up. I just put some rice on in the rice cooker just a little bit. And I have some veggies out that I'm going to make. So I'm going to do rice with a side of vegetable and, you know, then the meat with it too. So it's like still semi-healthy and it's not too much rice. I spurred per dish and it has some vegetables on there too. So it kind of balances out. Does it really balance it out? I really don't know. I'm just saying so guys, I think I'm going to end this video here and use the rest of the afternoon to really relax because right now it is 1.18. I got done cooking. The rice is in the rice cooker. And my husband did say he was going to come home and make the steamed vegetable. So I think I might leave that for him to do because I have sweet potatoes in the oven plus the rice that we could have for dinner. And then everything else could go towards meal prepping so thank you guys for hanging out with me on my day off i hope you guys enjoyed my video and i will see you guys in the very next one